do my hair with me. Room is dirty, so ignore that. I'm doing my makeup and I have to be ready in like 15 minutes. So do my hair with me. And my makeup. I'm gonna watch some Kindle Ray while I do my hair. Oh my gosh, like literally what is that? Okay, getting into my makeup now because I really don't have much time. We're gonna be super rushed, so bear with me. Literally have exactly 15 minutes. I really need to moisturize my face because it's so dry. Like I can literally feel it. Y'all know what's next? Sunscreen. Do my makeup with me while I'm in a rush. Okay, super goo. This is shade sunrise they have darker ones but i always make my bronzy drops in it anyway so yeah so guys i got my ears pierced i talk about it in another video but only briefly and i wanted to talk about how whenever you get your ears pierced with a gun versus a needle i feel like i can talk about it because i did my first hole was a gun at the doctor's office when i was like seven and then the second was a needle or this is really my second. Um, this was done with needle. The my actual second low hole was done with needle, and then these that I just got my third hole were done with a gun. And girl, the difference is crazy because I was literally about to go by myself and get it done at the like tattoo shop place that I go to at school because they the way they do it literally does not hurt. Like I mean it does, but it heals so quick. Like it does not hurt for like a really long time after like the gun does the gun is so rough i don't know the difference is just crazy i would definitely prefer needle over gun any day i guess when it clamps down it like pinches and it's also not like a really fine point on the earring and stuff so it just like it's just a little bit more rough it is more expensive like the price point is very different because it was 35 to get my third hole done with the gun but it's normally like 50 with the needle at least where i went the price difference is worth it as long as the person places it correctly and then also doesn't mess you up then it's worth it but as long as you don't mind the pain because it doesn't hurt that bad but like it definitely hurts worse than the needle if that makes sense like it feels like you just got pinched really hard in your ear and then it feels like that for at least an hour or two after whereas the needle i think my pain went away within like 30 45 minutes maybe less but i feel like that's exaggerating i don't know guys i'm going to florida this summer i'm so excited already planning my outfits in my head and like my little bathing suits and stuff i'm so excited blessed I'm gonna do this Rare Beauty blush. Last time I used my Neutrogena like multi-use stick thing and it's pretty good but this one's really pretty too. Shading Courage. I think it just stays a little bit longer than the Neutrogena one. We have 10 minutes to leave the house. It's 5.04. I have to leave at 5.15 so I can get there at 5.30. Some e.l.f. camo concealer. I don't know what shade. Something fair light maybe. I don't know. Fair warm. No, I want to do a um skincare routine i really only do skincare at night skincare in the daytime is literally this and my super goop sunscreen and i'm setting with this mac studio fix powder i've literally had this since like ninth grade probably maybe longer but it's so good i don't even know if they sell this anymore but it is mac instead of like baking i feel like i don't know i don't really bake my makeup just because i don't have anything to bake it with but I don't know. I like that. Now my bronzer. If I run out of this, I'm probably going to get either um, either Huda Beauty or is it Hula Beauty? Hula Beauty Bronzer or Physician's Formula Bronzer. That one. Three. Blush topper. I need my handy dandy ColourPop eyeshadow palette. This is like super pigmented, so it stays really well. My brow. Yes, I really need to pluck these bad boys. They're so bad. Glossier Boy Brow. I don't even know what shade this is. Brown. Of course. I don't even know if they have other shades. This. 
this highlighter for my inner corners. This is probably my fastest get ready with me. Let me do my mascara. I'll be right back. Telescopic and heat up your lash curler. It works wonders. I'm wearing my new shirt. It's very cozy. And the back is like, oh my gosh, I should have yanked out my eyelashes. This is my fastest get ready with me ever. So boring. Don't need to do a playlist video. Not that anybody really is interested in what kind of music I listen to, but just for me. Honestly, most days I'm listening to the same songs over and over again. And then like sometimes I'll branch out and go look at my old playlist. Really my SoundCloud is where it's at. My SoundCloud has some crazy, not crazy like bad, but like, like good selection. The only thing is when I listen to that, it like sends me back to high school and it's very triggering. I don't know if anybody else experiences that with listening to music, but I cannot handle that. Because <laughs> I did not really enjoy high school that I mean, I don't know. Some parts I did enjoy, so I can't really say that, but just some parts I didn't. And some of those songs, I guess, like, throw me back into that, like, if something does it for me, and it's like, ugh, I can't listen. I have to skip the song, or like, I don't know. Just deep rooted trauma. I have two minutes, so this is my album. <laughs> This is it. Ignore my room in this room. It's a shirt that I got from Shein. Y'all saw it in the haul. If you watched the haul, you know. If you didn't, go watch it. What are you doing? Um, but these are the shorts. They're a little lemon. And they're super cute. I don't know what they're called because I got them from my roommate. My friend. And these shorts are so cute. And cozy. And this is my makeup. Um, I really just forgot that I need to put on this. Let me put on lip stuff. Alright, my go-to lip combination is this Revlon Color Stay liner in shade nude. I'll do Summer Fridays in vanilla beige, I think. It's tart. Maracuja Juicy Lip in shade strawberry, just right in the middle. I gotta go now. <laughs> it's literally 5.15, so.